There we are for bike man, lots of wood on the key. Lots and lots of wood. How many trees has gone into making all this lot? It's all along there. And we come up to the corner and there's more wood. Now this is unusual. Looks like there's a fishing boat and it's registered in Shoreham. And it's called the Flowing Stream. Uh, there's three fishing boats in a row. Now that's very unusual to see British fishing boats in a British port. It's listing lazily to port, even though the gangway is on the starboard side. And uh, they've obviously got a small deck, or sorry, a small generator downstairs, keeping the lights on. As I can't see uh, clouds of smoke coming out the main exhaust. As you can see, it's a very poorly designed funnel as the uh, exhaust is coming backwards onto the back of the uh, funnel space blackening it with soot from the diesel. It looks like it's an oyster. Oyster fisherman. Well the looks of those those things there is probably catching the oysters. It's not something we have eat much in the UK is oysters. But yes. Another one. It's uh, definitely oysters. These are uh, four. Sorry, this is for Sylvia Bowers. There's another fishing boat for oysters. It looks like, I don't know if you can clearly see, but there's lots of these chain uh, net things here, obviously for uh, scouring the seabed as it comes along. Being towed behind the ship, scouring the seabed for oysters. Let's see where this one's registered. Dumfries. Honeyborn 3 by looks of it. I couldn't make out whether that one was a, was a 2 or a 3 as it was such a steep angle. Another one, Isla S. Dumfries. This one over here, yes, it's Honeyborn 3 which is registered in Peterhead. That, that there is the water from the cargo coming off. It's also mixed with a bit of seawater so the pump doesn't dry out. 